All right, this is a Subaru 2002 H6 three-point liter um, Outback. And it's the uh, pain in the butt trying to get the starter out. As you can see, there's the starter. What I've done is uh, written down the uh, sizes of the uh, bolts, nuts, whatever you want to call them. So there's a 916. 12 millimeter, they point it to where they belong. So when I get back, it'll be a lot easier. So this guy was a 12 millimeter. All right, now, trying to get this whole thing off, it's a pain in the ass because uh, we have to go underneath the car to get the bottom bolt out. This top one was pretty easy, but you have to get under the car to get access to the other one. So let's check that out. Here we go. Uh, as you can see, I had to take the wheel off. Put some jack stands under the car for safety. And for added safety, there is the uh, other jack. So just in case for some stupid reason the aliens come and knock these jack stands away, I'll still have that guy. That guy as my last safety. But, all right, here we go, under the car we go. it is right there right on top of my finger that's the last thing I got to unscrew how to get in there by taking the wheel out this is the socket wrench yep there it is let's see if I can do this with one hand with the phone and one hand on the nut <laughs> that sounds funny I can't reach. But anyway, there it is. You gotta take that thing off in order to take the starter out, put the new starter in. So you have to get under the car. There's daylight. All right. I haven't seen any videos on YouTube on how to take this thing off on a 2002 Subaru 3.0 Outback LL Bean, whatever you want to call this car. But uh, I figured I might as well put a video up. I couldn't find one. There's a 1997, 2005, 2007. And some of those seem like they're kind of in the same spot, but nothing for a 2002. So there you go. Trying to save the world one Subaru at a time.